Captain, with the Psi Disruptor's signal hampering the Zerg's communications to one another, the swarms over Char have scattered in disarray, allowing the fleet to penetrate to the planet's surface. However, there is still a considerable number of defenders nestled around the fledgling Overmind. Alexei was right. The Disruptor is the key to victory here. If I had destroyed the machine, as Duran suggested, we would never have made it this far. Nevertheless, the time is upon us, Captain, to do what we came here for. We will claim the Overmind in the name of humanity. Be advised, Captain. Our sensors have identified three Cerebrates who constitute the core of the Overmind's defenses. Each Cerebrate's distinct capabilities are still unknown. So proceed with extreme caution. Launch your forces, and let not a Zerg survive. Once you have reached the Overmind and crushed its defenders, you are to send in specially trained medics who will pacify the creature with potent neurostim drugs. Only then will our victory be assured. And Captain, remember that Duran is still out there somewhere. I'd venture again that his treachery has only just begun. Be careful. And good luck. I am sure that this will be our finest hour. Hey guys, it's Mike Lad, everyone. Base is under attack. Sir, these sunken colonies aren't being affected by anything we hit them with. I'll bet there's one of those cerebral critters pumping up full of energy nearby. Give me some of this shit. Stand it by. The hell are you attacking now? Oh, that one. Okay. Well, uh, not much we can do about that. Wait, wait what? It can't attack that one anymore. Okay, no, now it can. For some random re I don't understand. Whenever, whenever there's Marines in it, it decides to- whatever. What can I ask? Fucking Neurostim drugs. So, uh, for this last mission, uh, we're gonna do battle cruisers Because, uh... How we roll. Now, like, I don't want to never use battle cruisers. I just want to, you know, avoid using them until like the last mission. I, I always feel that. What the fuck? Stop doing that. It's it's always like a grand finale sort of thing. Like they're the most useful there, kind of a thing. So I feel I feel it's a good idea at that point. Also, these sunkins are all invincible, so it's actually not a terrible idea at this point to basically just go air now. Maybe I'll just, I'll toss in a couple of race also while we're at it, just because, uh, you know, we, we didn't really do them before. Uh, and I just noticed, like, there's, we just have, like, missile turrets on the outlying things. Interesting. I, I, I'm actually, I'm, I wouldn't be totally against, you know, having, a uh, what's what we call it, um, and, uh, like, Okay, force of marines. Okay, attack force of marines kind of thing. Yeah, these guys, okay, you know what? They're gonna just wreck them. Fuck it. I just changed my mind. Just move the engineering base all the way down here. Oh, this is not good. Let the, let the marines handle that. I mean, that's what they're good at, right? Because the turrets are way too far out. Are you guys aware of how lazy I really am? Probably not, but you know. Anything that requires actual effort is just like, it's just a no in my books. But anyways, um, so yeah, we're gonna build like a shit ton of starports and things like that. The, the biggest factor for for battlecruisers is the, the gas, so that's why we're kind of going for this expo really quickly. Um, even though, like, we're not really good with our minerals yet. Oh, actually, that's fine. Okay, I don't, I don't need to change anything. And then we have to build a bunch of medics and bring them to the center kind of a thing. Which will be easy, because we'll have dropship technology by then. Oh, don't, don't, don't bring it all the way back. Just, just stay right here. Alright. We just have to keep producing at this point. Uh, I guess, you know, I guess we can start building up the tech, so factory will start coming up. And yeah, he just kind of looks at it like, oh wait, I have gas. Like, I totally forgot. Completely slipped my mind. 
And then this guy's gonna be on supply depot duty, and usually I like to make the supply depots up here because there's really there's really no other use for this fucking huge place of land here. Uh, go go right here, make that there. So like I just like to kind of make the supply depots in the back. They really don't serve a person purpose. You know, usually in Starcraft, what you're doing is you're you're putting you're putting the supply depots in such a position where uh, they'll kind of like defend or wall off a base or something. But you know, I don't really do that. I don't know if you notice that or not. It kind of just Mike just does whatever Mike wants. Mike Mike makes a supply depot fucking thing in the back there. All right, so let's build two starports and start us off. You always always piss me off about Zerg because they always have detection. It's just it's just their thing. You know, race and shit becomes so much less useful. Oh god. Oh, we lost one. Okay, we need to bring these guys over here. Oh, whatever. They, these guys have it. Look at these fucking guys. Oh, okay, we'll, we'll actually start constructing something here. They don't attack the SCV that's building that. I like how the medic can actually heal them, though. That's the fucking best. Uh, we need a little more. Oh, wow. Got, like, a ton of these guys just waiting. Yeah, I don't really know how these guys are intended to kind of like. He should just go up here. All right, and then uh, we got to start on a on a science facility, which is not S. That one. All right, and then there's not much else I'm gonna do. Like, there's no point in tanks. Um, it just occurred to me I may want to get something with heavier firepower. Uh. Nothing really comes to mind though. Maybe just more marines. Let's do just two more marines. I just remembered what this mission throws at you, and it's not pretty. Additional supply depots required. Report for duty. Always supply depots. It waits a little bit because I'm supposed to be building something that does more damage. Uh, I'm not though. Okay, come on, just help him build. This is a co-op thing. Additional supply depot is required. Because I need SCVs. I don't know what I really need more, actually. Ah, oh, here we go. Okay. And just make the physics lab on top of that. That's it! And we'll just keep making SCVs everywhere. Because that's what we do. So, th there's like, uh, sorry, I never, I didn't show you guys. So, there's like one cerebrate here. And this cerebrate is obviously in control of the, uh, the the super sunken colonies. There's one over here surrounded by ultralist caverns. Absolutely no clue what that could possibly imply. And then one surrounded by infested command centers. Oh, once again, completely not a hint at all. And also the overmind. So. Oh, oh okay. Actually, no. Just run back. Oh, God. Oh, that's not good. Ah, that's not good. There's a lot of things that aren't good right now. Actually, no, no, don't, don't build that there. Build it right here. And also, this, this thing is burning, so let's go fix it up. And also do this. Reporting it. Man, they send a lot of attacks your way, which is why I think I used to make like a couple of tanks, just because. You know, they're annoying as shit. Alright, let's uh, get this medic over here. And technically I could have used another brain, but you know. No one ever said Mike was smart. It's just that Mike plays games. Alright, alright, oh wait, we can stop with the race now. And start with the battle cruises. Oh god, I already have so much gas. Delicious, delicious gas. So, um, you could attack with this, although I won't, because, uh, I'm not quite at the point where I'm comfortable moving out. I need at least 12 battle cruisers now. The limit I'm gonna say is, like, 6 battle cruisers, and that's it. And, then, you know, pretty much, like, I don't know, they're just OP as shit, because you can just win the game. Steve roll through everything. What are you doing? 
I wanna know what this guy's doing. Okay, he's trying to pathfind around those guys. It's interesting shit. I'll move out when I get like four of them or something. And also I noticed that this is uh no longer construction. Just gonna make like a fucking wall of this shit. So like with this, I'm just gonna go over here and bring the medic. I brought the medic here basically just to heal these guys. Because like really I don't want them to, like when the bunker breaks, they'll have a better chance of living. That's it. And now this medic can kinda just hang around those SCVs. I don't know if I really need that many more SCVs. You know, I'm gonna miss the Terrans because they have the best fucking music. You can say whatever you want about the Terrans. They're really good at music. So apparently, uh, the the not obviously not ultralisk related server didn't send anything at me, and I was able to check up the battle cruisers. That's interesting. You know, it, it also just occurred to me I didn't fucking make armories. Base is under attack. Oh, wait. Okay. Receiving transmission. Make it happen. I mean, we'll just, we'll just hover around here, you know, for no reason. Fucking, why do they take that stuff out? They're, they're fucking mean to it. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. No. Oh god, race, you suck. Get out of there. Okay, I, th I think I'd be better off just going like and making that over there. Also, the, that's the best voice of the Valkyrie. Uh, oh, tortured roar. I wonder what that could be. Right. And that's pretty much done. No Yamato, so we're kind of fucked for that. And then we'll just build race. Because I need race. Actually, I should build just another starport somewhere. Yeah, to, well, whatever. It's okay, you can go there. And we'll ship weapons and shit. Oh my god, I have fucking a ton of battle cruisers. And the game doesn't even care. I wonder what that tortured roar could be. Obviously a really slow creature of some sorts. I don't know. I, I really, I actually am really wondering where he is. Maybe it's like the 10 second warning. Oh, there he is. <laughs> that poor marine. So every once in a while, it sends a Taurusk your way. So, um... And the race will just pretty much make short work of that. Oh, I should really have something else. Maybe I should have, like, tanks or something. That would be pretty intelligent. Because uh, Marines are not doing anything to that. They don't... It doesn't even go through their fucking armor. Fine, we'll go over here, we'll make tanks. Alright, there, there you go, Lost battle cruisers. Alright. Oh no, hey, hey, hey. Everyone goes together. Okay, so we're just gonna, we're gonna just go right towards the Cerebrate. You're supposed to do some sort of either dropship attack or something else. You, you're supposed to do something against that. Alright, let's get some... Okay, it's, it's building it. This is probably the easiest one because there's literally no fucking offense against it. Like, like I don't even have that many battle cruisers. Come on, you have you have so much money you can just kind of hop the base. Yeah. Uh, actually, that's gonna bring them all over. Okay, well, that, that could be a problem that there's a tortured war. I don't know, go over here. Unfortunately, they're probably all gonna attack the wrong thing. 
Oh, come on. Hurry up. Oh, God. Eh, we lost the battle cruiser. Okay, that's it. We can we can just kind of bring him back. That's all you have to do. That's that's really. You can, there's so, so many strategies with this fucking thing. It's just you can either do like, uh, you can do like strike forces and all, all all kinds of other things as well. Like you can bring like a wraith like suicide squad with cloak. It it, it works. Oh, the battle cruiser is gonna be needed here. Oh god. Oh. Yeah, he, he kills him in one hit. And I can't repair this more, more than fast enough. It's like fucking 60 damage or something. Yeah, that would definitely be a whole can of whoop ass. Alright. Just uh, go repair some of these guys. Wow. Got like a ton of guys. Well, uh, there's, that thing's for basically nothing. We shouldn't have any trouble in the future, don't worry. I mean, like, it's the same deal with the... This cerebrace, we're gonna we're gonna steamroll right to him. Cause when you're when you're air, you get to skip a lot of shit. Especially when like the just sunkins. The sunkins aren't gonna do anything anymore, they're just useless. Alright, more race. Oh look, I got the first weapon upgrade. Oh, awesome. And I guess I'll do siege tanks for siege mode. I didn't think I'd do it, but I ended up doing it. That one's like, this one's like almost dead. There we go. We basically have another attack force, although I, I want to kind of like repair everyone first. Who's wounded? This guy is. Go repair that guy. And, ah, uh, the race didn't actually take a whole lot of damage. Mostly because I only brought like none of them with me. Alright, and you can just repair the last guy. Yay, tanks! I didn't think I'd make them. Made them anyway. I do that a lot. But, you know. Gotta do, I gotta repair this first. There's really no point in me getting detection because I'm just gonna waste my time with lurkers. Oh, God. Tortured roar is whatever I feel in my mind. Alright. Yeah. You see, not even the burst laser is gonna do all that much. The, the tanks will do enough to it, though. Just uh, bring the Marines in there. I mean, you could you could get like fucking a really cool like force of like siege tanks at the back here. Cause 70 damage is a lot. It just goes right through their armor. Two more, and then we'll be done. It's gonna get like some more Marines, and that's it. Taurus, you're so boring. Come on, get over here. Oh, there he is. Oh, he killed a marine. And almost a tank. What, what marine was out there? I thought, uh, he, might, he must have not fit in the bunker. He's like, uh, guys, make room, please. Alright, let's make a steamroll into there. Uh, they're gonna, they're gonna attack, like, every sunken colony along the way. Just ignore them, pretend they're not here. They're not gonna attack us, who, who gives a shit? Make it happen. I gotta wait. I gotta wait. Look for look around for Brown though. Brown's around. Man, tanks are so cool. Oh wow! No, no, I suck at micro. I, I was gonna do something clever. I think. There we go. Just, just everyone, everyone attack that. Oh god, there's still more red. Red, fucking red. Oh uh, wait, uh, it, it's okay. Did we just have this like this attack force of race, basically just to hang out? Okay, right. and oh, there we go. Look at that destruction central. Uh, just a, just a fucking beetle list. Alright, let's, let's build like two replacements just in case. No, we need supply depots. Oh, I guess I should make these guys do that. That's okay. 
Roger. It's not a big deal. We, 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 we can just let this money st kind of stockpile up. Oh, he, they hit one of my battle cruisers. Fuck. Oh. Anti error coming in. Now, that fucking spore thing you see there. Oh, fuck. They're not even attacking the right things. Whatever. You know, as long as. If they hit the race, then I don't care. Do I have more fucking race? No. Alright. Uh, need to build more shit. Oh god, he's here now! Evacuate the base. Oh fuck, the, the Razor are gonna have to come back. It's such an asshole thing for this game to do. The fucking, they're not gonna be able to do anything. Oh god, he killed all the fucking SCVs. They're all dead. All of them! God damn it. So you guys are gonna have to come over here. I know, can, can I just stack up? Oh jeez, the, the devourers, man. They, they, they lower the cooldown so you attack slower, it's so annoying. But the, it goes away eventually. Fucking stop defending your base. Okay, let just everyone come up here. Oh wow, he just killed those things. He's almost dead though. What? Why, why did, where did they all come from? Oh, this guy should probably head back. Nah, that's okay. Okay. Well, let's get everyone back. Let's get this attack underway again. Oh, fucking, of course, there's like two two of these guys that are now going to just kill everything. And, oh god, I need that base now. Jesus, I can't micromanage worth a shit. Okay, that, that guy will handle it. Okay, the rest of us, you know, we'll just ignore it, you know. Okay, oh Jesus, they put Dark Swarm here. You know what, no, I can't fucking get it. Okay. The, be the best turn strategy. Goodbye. Okay, everyone group up. Continue our little assault hero. Even though, you know, we can go after that. But I don't like this... This stuff making all that kind of crap, but whatever. Come on, just attack those. There you go. Alright, let's just everyone, everyone you out of that. I, I hate that thing. We shouldn't run up against any smacked up ultralisks anytime soon. Whew. Okay, so the last one, it does something related to infested turns, as you can see. It's kind of like whatever. Actually, I, I should make two more medics. Except I need an academy for that. Might as well make that. And also, these guys should just come over here and mine. Even though I really don't need the money, so I don't even know why I care. There. Good enough. Everyone mine that, that one thing. Alright. Let's go see what's up here, shall we? With my heavily wounded attack attack UED force. Yeah, I don't really understand how this one was meant to be a challenge. Yeah, I guess maybe in the second I'll understand. I mean, it just killed the, they just killed the battle cruiser. Whoa! For no reason. Oh, they have a lot of Hydra lists. And a lot of things that kill my battle cruisers. Okay, um, I changed my mind. We're gonna slowly retreat. No, I guess we're here until the end. Fuck! Oh my god! Eh, well then. So an insulting attack like that deserves nothing but the full, full fucking response of the, of the UED fleet. Don't judge me. Before you judge me, look in the mirror and ask yourself, 
fuck off. Set the course. I guess. In the cage. Fortunately, they're all together. Oh, Jesus Christ. AI is mission. kicking my ass. I feel horrible. Receiving but this is too much for you. It's too much. You can't do it. You can't win, Orange. Accept your fate. No, no, you're just delaying it. Oh, Jesus. No, we're gonna lose the battle cruiser. Go to the back. These are like three, three up, up battle cruisers too. For fuck's sake! Like I, I won't, I won't lie. I basically cheated and did this, and I'm just still having trouble. How many fucking hydralists does he have? What an asshole! We'll get there eventually. You won't even let me near the fucking cerebrit. Fuck you! I can snipe it. <laughs> I win. Oh, that's it. Need medical attention? Bring the medics up. Jesus Christ, look at what Orange was sending at me. I won't even lie, I barely won that. Although, you know, Marine Brett, medic could probably do this too. There's also gun infested command centers and all that kind of jazz. Oh. Did someone page me? Have, have fun going through that. So, like, they're just inactive, they don't do anything anymore. Stupid overmind. When will you learn? Battle cruisers are overpowered as shit. Man, these assets were sick forever to leave. Good day, Commander. In the cage. Well then. Take it slow. Everyone, target this guy. Make it happen. Battle cruisers, uh, they kill their wounded. They're not. They're they're assholes. What the hell? What color was this one? It's like blue. Captain, we've reached the perimeter of the overmind's nesting area. We can launch the mid team at any time, sir. I'm on the job. I'm doing it right now. And you just hurt? gotta bring him to each Did beacon. Page me? And that's it. You lose the medic, unfortunately. Captain, the medics are in place and are administering the neurostim treatments to the overmind. No, they're apparently playing dubstep instead. Uh, excuse me, Admiral, but I'd like to introduce someone to you. You ran, you son of a bitch. What's the meaning of this? Admiral de Gaulle, I've heard a lot about you. Ooh, what the hell are you? I am Kerrigan. The Zerg you've killed here and the Overmind which you've come to collect are mine. As is our mutual friend, Lieutenant Duran. You see, Admiral, there are a number of groups in this sector who feel that your involvement here causes certain complications. My associates and I intend to make sure that your reign is short-lived. You may find that difficult, you abomination, seeing as how I possess the means to disrupt your control of the Zerg. Ah, you're referring to your vaunted Psy Disruptor. It won't last you forever, Admiral. Sooner or later, I'll destroy it. Then I'll show you what the Zerg are really capable of. Oh, and by the way, Admiral, your friend Stukov was twice the man you are. <laughs> I'm glad you saved me the trouble of having to kill him. Never won this fight. Uh, guess we won't find out. Oh, it's the end of the Terran campaign. Zerg! The very mention of this terrifying race once brought fear to all who heard it. But now we can all rest easy, as our own forces now occupy their very homeworld of Char. Months have passed since our initial confrontation with the Zerg, and now Directorate forces have taken control of the planet Char, long since rumored to cradle the malevolent Overmind of the Zerg. The Overmind itself, an enormous living brain-like entity, 
dictates control of all the myriad Zerg forces, and it was believed to be planning an invasion of the Earth itself. Once on the offensive, our highly trained directorate forces were more than a match for the beast-like Zerg. Even their fiercest warrior breed could not defeat the greatest military technology in the galaxy. The Zerg forces on Char were completely decimated and their losses were tallied in the millions. But all wars have casualties, and while directorate losses were minimal, the fleet's Vice Admiral Stukov gave his life during the final valiant assault on Char. Memorial services were held aboard the directorate flagship Alexander. Vice Admiral Stukov truly knew the meaning of sacrifice. Yet his sacrifice was not in vain. The Overmind itself was the prize of the battle. Even now, Directorate Psychics and powerful drugs are keeping the creature pacified. The Overmind will undergo extensive research to ensure the continued safety of the United Earth Directorate and of all mankind.